They claim to not be grooming. They claim to not be doing what we fear. And I do believe that we have rock, rock optics. And I'm, I'm not using that as an exaggeration. And yet, things like this exist that make you question. Mom and Dad swing a party, a book aimed at children. Let's have a listen to just how educational, as they like to say, this actually is, shall we? Mum and Dad's swing a party. My parents are swingers, just like me. And tonight they're planning a swinger party. Mum went online to find some new friends. They do it like this every weekend. It starts with a contract and a bowl full of keys. Everyone looking for unicorns. Yes, please. They watch a few movies, give balloons to the boys. Everyone sleeps over and makes lots of noise. That is why every night I pray to have a swinger party for my birthday. Now at this point, can someone explain to me why a child or a child's book subject should be swinging parties and explaining what goes on at swinging parties to children and then explain to me how that is not sexualizing children far too young and grooming anyone please explain how that is not grooming now obviously the left have come out in defense his rooters fact check cartoon swingers book is meant for adults not children according to its author a children's book titled mom and dad swingers party is intended for adults did that read like it was intended for adults everyone contrary to online claims saying it was written for children so i thought i'd come and have a look at this book and this is Waterstones, Mom and Dad's Swinger Party. So it is a legitimate book. Rejected children's books. Rejected children's books. So even Waterstones recognises it as a grooming child's book. But the fact checkers are saying it's wrong. So we've got to believe the fact checkers, everyone. Stay sane. I'll see you on the next one.